Okay, so we are going to uh, remove a MIDI file from Unreal Pro over to GarageBand show you how to do that. So the first thing we're going to want to do is go over to Unreal Pro, select any one of the songs down the left hand side, in this case I've chosen 12 Bar Blues. We move up to the upper right hand corner with the export symbol, click on that, choose share audio, select MIDI. It's going to come up with a menu and the simplest thing to do when working with GarageBand is save it to the files. So we go to save files and then I choose to put all of my GarageBand related files into GarageBand for iOS. I choose add. It's going to come up with, it's not going to come up with any menu, it's just going to move it in, in that um, uh, that file name. So we're going to press the home button, go to GarageBand. All right, I am going to create a new song. So I go to new song, and it could be anything, uh, but I am just going to select a external. Let's try that. Oh no, I don't want to do that. Let's let's just choose I don't know audio recorder. Click on OK. We're going to go over to the uh, song the song mode here. We go in the upper right hand corner with the Apple Loops. And then we've got Apple Loops files and music. I choose files. Okay. I choose browse items from, uh, from the menu down at the bottom. Because one thing with GarageBand is it doesn't refresh that list very quickly. So you have to go there. Select 12 bar blues dot mid then I'm going to select that and I'm gonna bring it over and I'm gonna drag it in and put it right at the very at the playhead right at the beginning it will import the uh, the, the file it will include the initial click so when we go ahead and play this it'll include the first but then you know you've got your choice of all these uh, instruments and much higher quality. You can hear it, right? Anyway, I hope, uh, hope you like this.